There's no disputing it. In school, you certainly do learn a lot about the Earth, but there's only so much that they can teach you. Today, we're going to have a look at some seriously interesting facts about Earth that you probably didn't pick up in school. Number 32. It's getting hot in here. If it's heat you're after, then look no further than Libya. The hottest spot on Earth is said to be El Azizia, where temperatures have reached an impressive 136 degrees Fahrenheit. This occurred on the 13th of September, 1922. It's true there may have been hotter days elsewhere, but this one was officially recorded as the hottest. Number 31. Speaking of heat, we basically live on a giant furnace that could host many radioactive elements. We're led to believe that the Earth's magnetic field protects us from radiation, which is ultimately true, but it doesn't protect us from what's right under our feet. Dig anywhere and you could be digging up those radioactive elements. Physics World suggests that as much as 50% of the heat that Earth gives off is generated by the radioactive decay of elements such as uranium and thorium. Number 30. Junk in the Trunk At this exact moment, there are around 170 million pieces of junk, roughly 0.4 inches in size, sweeping around Earth at roughly 17,000 miles an hour. There are give or take 670,000 slightly bigger pieces of junk, and then around 29,000 pieces of much larger debris also circulating. Number 29. Happy unbirthday. Ask anyone and they will tell you that a year on Earth is 365 days, but the truth is, that's not quite the case. An actual year on Earth is 365.2564 days. The extra .2564 is why we have a leap year every four years. Number 28. 24, 7, 365. You often hear people saying that there are not enough hours in the day, and it seems they may be correct. A day consists of 24 hours, but that is also slightly off. The planet takes exactly 23 hours, 56 minutes, and 4 seconds to rotate on its axis. Number 27. As fast as lightning. Every single day, Earth receives roughly 100 lightning strikes every second. That's around 8 million a day and 3 billion yearly. Approximately 2,000 people get hit by lightning every year, which seems rather small considering how many lightning strikes Earth receives, doesn't it? Number 26. Safety in numbers. When you think of mammal migrations, you get a mental picture maybe of the 1.3 million wildebeest making their way between Kenya and Tanzania. It's mind-blowing to see. It's most certainly not the biggest, though. The accolade for biggest mammal migration goes to fruit bats. Around 10 million of these giant fruit bats fly between the Democratic Republic of the Congo and Zambia's Kasanka National Park each year. These bats are the size of cats, and each bat feasts on 5 pounds of fruit every night. Number 25. Double Trouble Did you know that Earth used to have two moons? There used to be a tiny moon, only around 750 miles wide. It's believed the second moon may have orbited Earth and then slammed into the moon we are familiar with today. The crash may be the reason that the two sides of the surviving one are so different from each other. Number 24. Follow the Yellow Brick Road It's been confirmed that there is so much gold on Earth that it could cover Earth in 1.5 feet of the shiny, expensive metal. Number 23. Going down. Isn't it interesting that we've been to the moon and Mars, but we've only scratched the surface of our own deep oceans? Our oceans contain 95% of our water, and even more than that in terms of living space, and we have yet to explore more than 10% of their depths. Over 200,000 marine species have been named, yet it is believed that up to 30 million remain undiscovered. It seems it's harder to travel through water than space. Number 22. Large and in charge. The largest living thing on Earth is not what you'd expect. A blue whale, perhaps, springs to mind, or maybe massive redwood trees. But there is something much bigger, and it's a fungus. In Michigan in 1992, what's now known as the Armillaria mushroom was discovered. It covered over 30 acres then, but has grown to an estimated 1,800 acres at the time of this video. Adding to the size of this living organism are roots that penetrate much farther down than any other mushroom species. Number 21. An alien landscape. One of the strangest looking landscapes on Earth would be Ethiopia's Danakil Depression. Believed to be the hottest place in the world, it is also one of the most inhospitable with deadly gases, lava lakes, colorful acid craters, and hot springs peppered over a vast, crackling salt pan. Even in an environment as extreme as this, life exists. The colorful hydrothermal vents have been found to contain ecosystems on a microbial level, which astrobiologists and physicists are studying for clues in the possibility of life beyond Earth. 
Number 20, the color purple. A microbiologist from the University of Maryland named Shilda Sarma believes that at one point in time, the Earth used to be purple. Just like all of our green we have today, well, imagine that, but purple. He says that ancient microbes may not have used chlorophyll to harness the rays of the sun, but rather another type of molecule that would give off a violet hue as opposed to green as we know it. Number 19, search and you will find. Ever felt like looking for meteorites? Can't say we have, but should that type of adventure appeal to you, then head to Antarctica. There's very little vegetation there with a ginormous snowy landscape, making it probably the ideal spot to find meteorites. Apparently more meteorites have been found in Antarctica than anywhere else in the world. Number 18, there she blows. Did you know that Yellowstone National Park is in fact a huge volcano? Not very reassuring, is it? Don't be too alarmed, because the last time it erupted was before humans were even around. The ash it let off reached the Gulf of Mexico. Number 17, it's a cloudy day. But look a little more closely at those clouds. There's a chance it may be alive. Murmuration is a word used to describe hundreds of thousands of starlings flying together that look very similar to a gigantic cloud. The acrobatic synchrony of these birds in flight is absolutely phenomenal. Scientists aren't quite sure why they do it, but suspect they're looking for a spot to roost or trying to evade predators. Number 16, a little pixie dust. Every day, Earth is sprinkled with a little dust from the heavens. Research claims that around 100 tons of interplanetary material floats down to Earth on a daily basis, mostly just as a fine dust. For example, comets give off tiny particles as their ice vaporizes when they get close to the sun. Number 15, paint it black. There are no true black flowers on Earth. The darkest color flowers are generally very dark shades of purple or red. The pigments that flowers use to generate color are said to not be able to produce black. It's man that has managed to manipulate the shading so that certain flowers produce black. And now you get the black rose, viola, and hyacinth. Number 14, what's in a name? All the planets except Earth are named after mythological gods or goddesses. Saturn, Jupiter, Uranus, Mercury, Venus, Mars, and Neptune. Earth, on the other hand, derives its name from an old English word, Eartha, meaning ground or land. Number 13, nobody's perfect. We generally think of Earth as being the perfect sphere, but it isn't. There's a slight bulge near the equator. Earth spins roughly 1,000 miles per hour, giving it an oblate spheroid shape as opposed to an actual sphere. So the middle of the Earth near the equator has a slight bulge. Number 12, Brokeback Mountain. We can thank the shifting of rocks for our mountains. Although we can't see the tectonic plates, their shifting movements leave behind monumental changes to our environment. If you look at the Himalayas, they stretch an impressive 1,800 miles. This mountain range started forming between 40 and 50 million years ago. Back then, India and Eurasia collided due to plate movement. Number 11, Pass the Salt. The saltiest ocean of all is said to be the Atlantic Ocean. The excess fresh water in the Atlantic gets carried to the Indian Ocean. Water vapor from the North and South Atlantic Ocean also contribute to its excessive saltiness. Number 10, under the sea. Not only are there all those undiscovered animals, but there are also mountains. The mid-ocean ridge system is an underwater mountain range that stretches almost 50,000 miles and is longer than the Andes. Number 9, let it snow. Ever thought of how much snow actually falls each year? In case you have, here's your answer. One million billion cubic feet of snow falls every single year and weight? Roughly a million billion kilograms and a billion ice crystals in every cubic foot. In layman's terms, an astronomical amount of snow falls each and every year. Number eight, the Big Bang. In April of 1815, the largest volcanic eruption recorded by humans occurred at Mount Tambora. It ranked a seven, or a super colossal, on the VEI, which stands for Volcanic Explosivity Index. It's been recorded that the explosion was so loud that it was heard on Sumatra Island, which is 1,200 miles away. 71,000 people fell victim to the explosion, and ash lay heavy on many islands that were far away. Number seven, life's a beach. We've chatted about how much snow falls each year, but you have to marvel at how scientists have even managed to figure out how much sand there is on Earth. There is roughly seven quintillion, 500 quadrillion grains of sand on Earth. Number six, hot under the cover. We know that the sun is hot, but did you know that the very core of Earth is the same temperature as the sun? Basically, it's like really, really hot. Number five, fresh squeezed glaciers. One glacier could potentially contribute 10% of Earth's meltwater. Most of the world's fresh water is contained in ice caps and glaciers, and when they melt, sea levels rise. Number four, three's a crowd. 
but in Manila, it's more like 1,660,714 is a crowd, and all of those people are crammed into 14.8 square miles of living space. Number three, make like a tree. Currently, there are roughly three trillion trees in the world, so around 400 trees per person. It sounds amazing, but since the beginning of human civilization, we've lost nearly half of our trees. Every year, we lose 15 billion trees, thanks to humans. Number two, a little parched. The driest spot in the world is the Atacama Desert of Chile in Peru. There are some spots in the desert that have never, ever, ever seen a drop of rain. Number one, light at the end of the tunnel. Apparently, if there was a tunnel from one end of the earth to the other, it would take 42 minutes to fall all the way through. Live science reports that this would only work if there was a thoroughfare through the gravity tunnel. And of course, if it was physically possible to, you know, drill a hole right through the center of the earth. Thank you guys so much for watching. Did you learn anything new? Leave a comment down below and a like if you enjoyed this video. And subscribe for more daily content just like it.